Hey everyone, Steve Del Monte, Delmo Sports. In two weeks and two days, the fifth annual Escape the Cape Triathlon presented by Inspira will take place. Something I'd like to talk to you about and something you can see clearly in this picture, wetsuits, right? Four critical things you need to know about wetsuits and triathlon or open water swim. Number one, there are swimming wetsuits and there are surfing wetsuits. Let me have a surfing wetsuit, please. This is, it's a great wetsuit. This is for surfing. I want you to take a really good look at it. Now, for those of you that are familiar with triathlon and have been doing this forever, this video is not for you. This is for the new triathlete that's never purchased. Look at this wetsuit. I want you to look at texture, okay? See how it's made? This is not for open water swimming. This is for sitting on a surfboard to keep you warm when the water is cold, the air is cold, or for paddling or stand up paddling. It's not meant for you to be swimming for a mile in a lake or a river or an ocean. Can you do it? Yes. Is it going to be efficient? No. Okay. Now here's a swimming wetsuit. Let's go. That was a weak toss, by the way. Now, this, my friends, is a tricked out tier hurricane wetsuit. All right, I want you to take a good look at this now. Okay, look at that. See how silky smooth, right, and shiny the sleeves are, all right? This is meant, the sole purpose for this is open water swimming, okay? Open water swimming. You're gonna glide through the water much faster in this suit than this suit. Look at the difference. Can you see the difference in the suits? It's clear as day. Please, don't be the person that shows up in this wetsuit. Oh. Second thing, long sleeve wetsuits versus short sleeve or sleeveless wetsuits, okay? Something you wanna know about that. Long sleeve versus sleeveless. If you did not grow up as a swimmer, if you are not on a master's team and you're simply going to the pool to get some yardage in to complete this swim and you've decided to purchase or rent a full uh, long sleeve suit, I highly suggest that you practice in this thing first. Number one, you are going to feel major resistance on your shoulders. You are not used to wearing this thing. It's going to be very uncomfortable and I guarantee you within 30 seconds of jumping in that water, you're gonna be thinking, I can barely get my arms over my head. That's generally what happens with a long sleeve wetsuit. These muscles need to be developed and able to handle that, that resistance from the neoprene. Two, the sleeveless wetsuit is gonna be a much better friend of yours, okay? There is no resistance because your whole shoulder and arm is free. You can really get extension, okay? You can really get extension. So I want you to think about if you're new to the sport, is to go sleeveless first, okay? Go sleeveless first. Three, to rent or to buy. Luckily, we have a fantastic partner in Tier, our official swimming sponsor, and Try Everything, which is our official retail partner. Try Everything right now has wetsuits available for Escape to Cape to rent, and if you, if you love the suit that much, you can actually purchase that suit at a discount. So please, visit Try Everything online. You can go through Dumbo Sports to do that or visit their website. Click on Wetsuit Rental and you can get yourself a wetsuit for Escape the Cape. Pick it up at Packet Pickup. You can test it out in the water and see if it's right for you. So again, swimming, surfing. You don't want that one in the water. You want this one. Steve Dalmani, Dumbo Sports, over now. Thank you.